Welcome back to the channel, everyone. Thanks again for joining me. Here we are with our final box of Bowman Chrome Sapphire Edition for 2023. My last one. Unless... Unless maybe something happens and I can come across a few more boxes of these. Uh, at a fair price, but... I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. If I get something big here, maybe I will. Yeah, I will be tempted to get another one, but I haven't gotten an autograph, and that's something I'd like to see. I'd like to see an autograph pop up of one of these for myself. Maybe a one of one, maybe not, but some kind of autograph would be great. <clears throat> so, again, if you haven't already, please subscribe. Again, drop a like and a comment, maybe. Let me know... Uh, let me know what your page is named. I would like to follow. And, you know, in return, maybe get a follow back from you. Oh, uh, I want to help out where I can. So, if you want some help with your channel, I'd be more than happy to help. Any way I can. Had a few people reach out to me. They're totally interested in collaborating and working with other people, but so far I am working solo. Not really working. Just enjoying the hobby and having fun with, you know, having fun with showing what I can. Here we go. Anthony Rizzo starts it off. Byron Buxton. Angel Cepeda. And then we have Cam Collier. <coughs> so looking around on eBay, even the base cards versions, uh, people are paying or trying to paying. Uh, they are actually buying, uh, buying these cards the loose base cards for hundreds of bucks. Uh, uh, unbelievable to me. But I guess that's the popularity of it. Miguel Vargas. Miguel Cabrera. Marco Luciano. And Dean Jorge. Okay, I feel like we got a few more doubles added to uh, my set. Um... Also, for you out there, whoever is collecting this, trying to make a set, uh, you notice my doubles, uh, and you see some thick cards that you haven't gotten, and maybe some cards that I haven't gotten, or Henderson, all right, maybe we can do some trades here and there. Uh, nice rookie card, Logan O'Hop. And we have Jace Young, Kevin Parada. Yeah, so I've gotten a few of certain cards. Uh, I only got one Ethan, Ethan Salas. Uh, the, that image variation of Anthony Vault, uh, though, with the color that I pulled in the first video. Uh, that one. That one. I haven't seen any other ones with it like it, but... Uh, just the base version of that one was going for about 160 bucks, 180 bucks maybe. It's up on eBay. Nolan Gorman, Mike Trout, Drew Jones, John Mejia. All right. No colors yet, but we'll work in there. We'll get there. It's supposed to be one guaranteed Sapphire edition per box, but I'll hunt around, I'll see what I can find for uh, fairly priced uh, Sapphire Edition boxes, maybe we can continue the hunt to put together a set, but, oh, here's our first color, Bo Nailer, Bobby Witt Jr., and then we have Xavier Isaac, 38 of 75. Junior Caminero. There's a popular one. 
There's a popular one. Not really. I don't think I've came across that one, so another one to add to the set. that one and that good rookie card Shay Lungaliers Luis Angel Cuna and then Adrian Rodriguez CJ Abrams, Yuri Perez, Spencer Jones, and then we have Fanin Celestine. Our last pack. Let's hope it's something. Next episodes will be featuring, uh, what is it, the uh, 2023 Topps Chrome update. Got a bunch of boxes I'm going to be breaking open, one by one. So please don't forget to subscribe, so that way you can be updated as we hunt for that one-on-one -on -one patch of Anthony Bolt. Ben Joyce, here's our last color. Jet Williams, 4 of 99. All right, take it. Angelo Sarmiento. And then Sebastian Walcott. All right, first moment. I'll take that one. All right, well, nothing huge, but again, we got our colors. Now I got a little surprise. I'm gonna open up another Topps T206 in this video, just for good measure, in hopes that we get something interesting out of here. Now I'm gonna do a little more in detail uh, jump on this one, the T206 High Series. Uh, been sold out, it came back out after it was sold out the first time, and then uh, they sold out. people in the comment section uh, thankfully they pointed out to me that uh, I made some mistakes each of the packs contains a card or two cards at the very top of the deck uh, very top of the pack that are the pulls or the hits I should say box comes with four packs. Here we are. The packaging on this is very clean, very neat, very well put together. The card quality on these is uh, very, I, I just got to say it's there. The prints are always great. I never get uh, anything messed up, so. There we go, we have Solaire. And there's the polar bear back. On the first card. And then we have Batista. With the Piedmont backing. Seems like they might have another one. It's a regular backing for Joey Bart. All right, now we have Carlton. Green rookie card. Castillo. Uh, oh, wow, a McKenzie one of one. First time I've seen a one of one. There we go. Yeah, 
That's great. Nice hit. Nice hit. Right. Take that one. I got Clace. Gonzalez. A rookie card for Vulp. All right. All normal backing cards. And then Lofton. Ends up with the normal backing as well. Nice hit on that McKenzie. I don't see too many videos popping up of uh, the T206, but uh, if you have an interest in them like I do, uh, here they are. So we have uh, Williams starting it off. Carolina Bright's backing. Well, uh, is that him there? And then we have McCovey. The Piedmont backing. Now, like I said, the quality on these cards, the print is amazing. Uh, the stock thickness is it's good. It's quality. It's there. There's no warping. I haven't found any bent cards at all. So we got a Williams. Bernie Williams back in normal. We got Frank Thomas. We have a normal print. Kenzie. I'll set that down right here. Wow. There we go. Just for contrast. The one of one print and the normal print. So just for showing that. My first uh, one of one hit. We have Swan Juan Soto. And then Jose Altuve. Normal back normal backings. We got Wakefield, Kemp, and Smith, all with uh, normal backings there. So I did pull a Tristan Casas autograph on this one of one for Mackenzie. That's a that's one of my first big one of one hits ever. See what else we come up with in, in the packs here. Corbin Burns. Oh, we got our 205 series card here. All right, so top is Duran with the polar bear backing. Seeger, the Piedmont backing. France. And we have a rookie card for Drew Waters. Normal backing on that one. I'm pretty sure most of these cards have the normal backing, unless uh, unless it's at the top. But I will go back and do uh, do some looking over after. All right, Riley is there. Let's see, what is this one? Vaughn Grissom rookie card, T two o five border. Nice. I like those variants, T two o five design. Uh, that's a good hit there. Normal backing still, but can't complain. And we have Oscar Colas rookie card. A gallon. 
Pina, Darvish, Burns, all normal backends. Please, again, if you haven't subscribed already, subscribe. You got nothing to lose. I'd definitely check out your pages and subscribe as well. Uh, maybe do some trading. I will be trying to acquire some more tops. Uh, bum Chrome Sapphire. But, uh, we'll see. That all depends. We'll be opening up those uh, Tops Chrome Update Series box hobby boxes. So check it out for that. Check out videos of that coming up. We got the Vientos rookie card. Oh, American National. Okay, I haven't seen that backing yet. This is new to me, a lot of this. Put that down there. Oh, Cortez. The Piedmont backing. The strength of these cards is very nice. They, they don't just... I don't know, they, it, it's, yeah, the quality is nice. It's like a 70s baseball card almost with the paper that they used. The Sean Murphy plain backing. We have a Freeman. Miller, rookie card. We have Julian. Lou Gehrig. Johnny Bench, Mount Castle, and we have Prado, all right, not bad, not bad on the hits with this one, so, yeah, if you like the Topps D206 cards as well, as I do, then uh, try to get those for yourself, <clears throat> nothing too amazing on the hit side. Uh, it's not so much like the Bowman, the Bowman Chrome Sapphire, but the hits are more few and far between for this series. Uh, thanks again for joining me. Uh, please don't forget to subscribe, like, share, comment, uh, get involved. I'm going to be giving away very soon uh, our next giveaway, starting that up. Uh, and I want to start doing something bigger. For my next giveaway so i'd like to get the allen and ginter cards off and run into their new homes uh, and so that way we can break open some more uh some more uh, cards and then uh, have more giveaways so uh thanks again let's take a little look of this if you're interested still here uh one of one comparison backing yeah that is just solid so very happy with that very happy with that one but all right thanks again take care see you later